What is going on everybody? It's a beautiful day today here at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida. And we've been seeing a lot of really nice coaches coming and going, but this 2008 Beaver Contessa just became available for $122,222. And I had to get you guys a sneak preview of this coach. Those of you that know Beaver, that know the Monaco Corporation, this is a quality on another level than any of the production motorhomes on the market today. This is on the Roadmaster chassis. It's got the cat motor with 400 horsepower, a 10,000 pound towing capacity, the tag axle. But when you see the interior of this coach, you're gonna really understand why it's such a good value. It's only got 42,000 miles on it. And the best part about this coach is it's available here at the Motor Coach Store where it's undergoing an extensive PDI and detail process. And when you take delivery of this coach, they'll take their time going over the coach with you. You can spend the night in the coach making sure you understand how to operate all of the different systems. The Motor Coach Store is a boutique dealership and you're gonna get a completely different experience than you would at the big box stores out there. Let's take a look inside first and then we'll come outside and go through the basement bays. Going into the front door here, you can just see how good of condition this screen door is in. It's got the little beaver emblem on the inlay of your door there. This coach is extremely clean inside. And the first thing I want to point out that really caught my attention is the chocolate color leather with the button tough backing there. It's got a nice little curve. And then the booth that does match with the midship TV. And when we look closer at all of the woodwork, Beaver was really well known for their woodwork and everything is in the wrapper in this coach. It's extremely clean, lots of cool little details like the puck lighting in this wood inlay above your dinette. You've got a good amount of storage on your driver's side slide room here above your sofas. Love seat area here and this has a lot of stuff that's not going to break. Like a lot of the higher end coaches of this vintage are going to have power blinds where you're pressing buttons and sometimes in coaches like this it's nicer if you can just have manual shades. It's less stuff that's going to break and as we put all this stuff up and down it's all extremely clean all of the valances you can tell that this coach has been very well cared for and this will jackknife out maybe sleeping for like a smaller child I don't know if an adult would be able to lay out on there but this sofa does have a pull-out sleeper as well and this is really nice how this kind of curves around if you want to get a nice look at your Sony TV up front but you do have the large midship Sony TV as well and coming back up to the cockpit I want to point out the the two-tone piping on these leather seats, extremely comfortable. The steering wheel is in very good condition and we're running that big 10,000 watt generator right now. We've got the ACs running on a hot Florida day and it's very quiet, you know, with that big piece of equipment running right now. Get your simple windshield wiper, cruise control settings on your steering wheel, map light, your Allison transmission, gear selector, your engine brake, engine block heater, battery boost, high idle all that your CB radio a couple of nice cup holders here you have outlets right here next to your driver I like that easy spot to plug in a cell phone charger and then simple dash air controls in this nice wood inlay simple dash and really a nice driving coach on the Roadmaster chassis coming back into the galley you've got the little pull-out peninsula here to get some extra countertop space you've got the, the sharp microwave the inside of every cabinet that I've opened up is very clean. You do have adjustable shelving lined with carpet. It does have the solid surface sink covers that match the countertop as well as the solid surface cooktop cover. Looks like you got your Adwood stove here though. For those of you that like to cook on the stove, that's a three burner. And then storage here in this peninsula area. Now, this coach does not have a dishwasher, but you do have this large drawer space here as well as a lot of storage for your sink. And then it's got this nice little spot here where you can put your sink covers there. 
We do have a residential refrigerator, and I like the way this hallway kind of zigzags to give you some privacy back in the bedroom with a little bit of storage to the right of your refrigerator utilizing that space. And then your stackable washer and dryer here uh, just across from your refrigerator a little bit back. That's a Whirlpool washer and dryer. And a nice size pull-out pantry here. Beautiful woodwork. Mid-bathroom with a corner sink. Real good size shower here with a radius shower door. And then you can even sit down if you want. And then it's got a separate room here for your toilet. Lots of room in here if you didn't need to change or something. A second sink in your toilet room, as well as a medicine cabinet. Beautiful tile work on the backsplash. And then some of your breaker panels above your toilet there. And a little storage back there for some TP or whatnot. And then coming back here into the bedroom, we've got a king size bed, a lot of wardrobe across the back of the coach, a Sony TV in your bedroom, you've got nice drawer space here with the multi level countertops. And I kind of like when you see this, I like to use this as a bench, actually a little spot to sit down and maybe tie your shoes. I don't know if that's supposed to be meant for people to sit on, but a nice little countertop space either way. And then you have those deep drawers below that. And then we do have the ceiling fan running in in the bedroom here and big deep storage above your bed for extra pillows or blankets and stuff. On the exterior of this coach, I love the cream colors with the brown and red stripes. A really unique paint combination. Really pops, especially after the full paint correction it has received here at the Motor Coach store. But let's open these bays real quick. The first bay is going to house your Aqua Hot 450D as well as your diesel fuel tank. And bay two is going to be a manual slide tray. And this coach actually has a ladder that we can hook onto the back of it if you do need to climb on the roof and these bays are very clean everything is lined with carpet bay three is going to be a full pass through bay i do see outlets there and bay four is going to be your propane tank we've got your chassis batteries simple battery disconnects there's a look at that big dog cat motor you've got access to your belts access to a lot of your fluids a lot of value in this motor a lot of folks out there are big fans of this cat so to get into this price range usually when you're in that hundred thousand dollar plus price range a lot of the coaches are going to be a rear radiator but a lot of value in this being a side radiator coach much easier access to work on this engine you got your 50 amp supply here there's that that side radiator I was talking about. And check out how clean this plumbing bay is with that brushed aluminum. You've got a shower outside here. You can monitor your tank levels, outlets, your sewer dump, power hose reel. And here's a look at that full pass through bay. And this being behind the slide room here gives you a little bit easier access to this big bay when your slide rooms are out. Now you do need to duck down to get to that bay up here that does have the slide tray that will come out both ways to make loading and unloading easier. They have a slide tray in the bay that's below the slide rooms, then the bay that's behind the slide rooms is completely open because typically you can crawl in there a lot easier. Then here's the other side of the diesel fuel tank and your fresh water holding tank is housed up front here. Up front we're running that 10,000 watt Cummins owning generator right now, but you can see this front end is extremely clean. I'm not seeing any chipping on the paint, only 42,000 miles definitely in excellent condition so this coach is available here at the motor coach store in Bradenton Florida for hundred and twenty two thousand two hundred and twenty two dollars if you're looking for a tag axle diesel pusher high quality coach pre def a very classy interior ten thousand pound towing capacity with a cat engine there's a lot of value here serious and qualified buyers can contact Bradley Twait his information is available at the motorcoachstore.com thanks to all of you that are subscribing. We hope you're all having a great day.